Good day everyone and welcome to day 273, turn 273 of your daily Civ 7 news update. Unified by the new religion of Islam, the early Arab caliphates expanded rapidly across the Mediterranean and eastward into Persia. In this world, Baghdad, the capital of the Abbasid dynasty, thrived as a centre of learning and culture. Arab scholars advanced astronomy and mathematics, philosophy and art, until, like the fall of night, the Mongols appeared on the eastern horizon. As an exploration age civilization, the Abbasid are focused mainly on science and culture, with a little bit of gold generation thrown in there too. I'll let you read all of the information for yourself on the game guide page. But we have another Civ here with one of these cool civilian units that come with a random effect when you create them. Don't get me wrong, I wouldn't be surprised if these effects end up getting removed or reworked at some point, because it feels like the variance on them might be a little too insane. But I love them. I'm a big believer that adding a little bit of randomness to games actually creates a higher skill ceiling as it forces you to play around the unknown. Much more fun to me uh, than always having a predetermined build order that you always want to go for, like in StarCraft 2 for example, and I think this is something Civ has always done well to avoid. That's all I've got for you today. I'll see you all tomorrow, but until then, thanks for watching.